out there uh -oh, this morning. I was going to say, pretty picture. You can see the sun starting to come up from behind the clouds. That's nice. Yes, and this storm we're seeing could bring up to a foot, a foot of fresh snow in the mountains. Denver 7's Nicole Brady live along I-70 this morning in the foothills where the snow falling could cause some backups if you're headed out to the slopes, Nicole. It absolutely could. It should be another good ski weekend, as you mentioned, and we are already seeing traffic building on I-70 this morning behind us. If you're heading westbound, earlier is better, but uh, already some wet roads, slick spots, and of course, we do expect more snow to continue falling. Here in Golden, it should be falling more by this afternoon. Now, I want to talk a little bit about this year's snowfall. We've had a lot, it seems like, even in the metro area, but the drought conditions have not seen a huge impact. Uh, it takes years to really see much of a turnaround, and we can look at the drought portal from the U.S. government here, and that red over the last month has reduced a little bit. So extreme drought conditions in the southwestern part of the state, uh, a little bit better, but it's still a concern. And then here along uh, the metro, right here along the foothills, we're still seeing that abnormally dry weather despite the fact that 19 and a half inches of snow have fallen this season in Denver. That's the official airport total. We should actually be at 35 inches by the end of February. We're already looking ahead to the spring and summer and wondering what the runoff situation will be. Rafting companies uh, last summer didn't have such a great season. This year expecting a little bit better, but uh, I just wanted to kind of remind you that summer is coming.